Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today is, hold on y'all, y'all like cricket. Today is moving day. Finally, you guys, finally, after a year of staying at my mom's place, we are finally getting ready to move today. Today is April 29th, I believe. Um, I'm packing up my desk. I'm washing a ton of clothes. I don't know if my husband's gonna take our wash and dry over there today, but it's the beginning of a new journey for us. We are not moving into our dream home just yet, but we are moving to the, um, one of our investment properties, which I've mentioned to you guys already. But yeah, today's the day. So I'm packing up my office for well, my desk area. It's not an actual office, my little corner. Um, and I'm honestly just gonna throw all these papers in my bin for now and sort them when we get to the house because I don't feel like doing that when it comes to my daughter. Yes. Your shoes? Yes, I pinky. Downstairs. They're downstairs by the door. Mom. So guys, this is the beginning of a new journey for us. I'm so excited about it. We get to start vlogging again um, because we'll be in our own space and you know, I'm gonna have to vlog around people. Um, so I'm really excited. The house still does need quite a bit of work, um, but it is finished enough for us to live in. It is not um, a mess anymore. Walls are up, walls are getting painted. Um, are completely done so we're good to go and i'm so excited about it. so yeah i'm gonna get back to packing um getting all this stuff together and i will talk to you guys in the next clip hey guys welcome back to another vlog so you guys today is a great day today is a crazy day today is an exciting day today is the day we are in our house happy friday happy friday big boy said we are in our house finally it's our first night staying here it's getting dark as y'all can see it's probably about eight o'clock now um and i'm gonna show y'all the condition um of the house right now it still needs a lot of work i'm not going to the store but we are safe the house is clean Dude, my husband's hooking up the tub and the toilet right now so we got all the essentials then then we, then we just had to paint my room yes your room is almost finished painting getting painted have a little bit more paint to do so <clears throat> this is where we're sleeping tonight it is a hot mess but i'm trying to show y'all the real and the process of everything so this is where we're sleeping all the toy kids toys are in here um, we've been bringing them over here for the past like month or so so it is full of toys in here this are, these are the kids mattresses this is what we're gonna sleep on tonight just put them together and sleep on that um, so yeah this is what we're sleeping tonight we just have a lamp in here for now because we need to hook up a light to the okay so this is the hallway um, yeah let me show you what we got going on so this is gonna be our room this room has already been primed um, we just have to paint it, but we haven't chosen a color yet. So for now, we're just going to pull up all of this um, that's covering the floor, and we'll paint the floors later. And then, same thing, all of the rooms need lights, but we have the wire in. This is the kids' room. It just needs like a little bit more sanding, and then the ceiling primed, and a few more things primed, and then their room will be done as well. This is the bathroom. This room has been primed. Um, where there is no drywall, we're gonna put the rock up there because we're actually tiled in the shower. So my husband is installing the toilet. <laughs> so yeah, we still have to put the rock up there so that we can um, put up the tile. But for right now, we have the toilet installed. Made the tub installed. He is installing the toilet, and we still have to get a vanity. And then this is the kids' playroom. Same situation. This room has not been primed yet. Hopefully we get to prime it tomorrow so that we can bring all those toys out of there into here because they have a lot of them. And then downstairs, this light just needs a light bulb. I don't know why I'm telling y'all the lights are probably gonna be dark. Hey, can y'all stop yelling? I'm recording. And then this is the condition of downstairs. Down here, the wall still needs to be sanded. Sorry y'all. The wall still needs to be sanded and then everything needs to be primed still. But all the floors everywhere are done, which I've already mentioned. And we actually attic. have a light hooked up here. And the attic is still dirty. The attic is dirty. <laughs> um, yes. And then this is the dining room. There is no light in the dining room, but same thing. Everything down here still needs to be sanded and primed. Um, we were more so concerned about the upstairs since that's where we'll be sleeping. It won't take much for us to sand and prime down here. And then that's the kitchen. It is really dark back there. 
but we do have our new refrigerator in there we just bought a refrigerator yesterday i'll show you guys that tomorrow when it's light outside i actually have to go grocery shopping um tomorrow so i'll show you guys that then and that's what's going on i probably won't record too much more tonight but i will definitely see you guys tomorrow Bye. <laughs> yes y'all i will see y'all in the morning we are about to go relax watch some tv all the things and i will catch y'all in the morning another vlog it's probably a continuation it is day two of moving day moving day two um i have not vlogged much at all today i think i only recorded once which is when i was cleaning up our room while i was pulling up the painter's paper and sweeping and mopping the floors that's really all the footage i got um we haven't done much today but we've done a lot today at the same time um so earlier this morning we really just ran errands nothing too exciting once like home depot i did a grocery pickup and that was really about it i think um got breakfast because we didn't have any food here that type of stuff we came back my husband has literally been working on the plumbing all day um so he just finished that he was plumbing the tub and the toilet the toilet is actually done he was working on the tub so we take a bath tonight um so i'll show you guys that now we just got done bringing in all the groceries that i got today and he's getting ready to set up like a makeshift table for us because we still don't have kitchen cabinets y'all roughing it we're roughing it out here but it's all good because like i said once again we are in our own home we are happy we're healthy and everything clean well kind of clean and here comes Mom, okay so yeah i'm gonna show you guys what the bathroom looks like right now right now it's torn into shreds he still hasn't gotten the walls up he's just been focused on getting all the plumbing done um he's gonna do the wall put the walls up tomorrow for right now he's just gonna put up like plastic around so no water gets behind but we can still take a shower and the kids can take a bath i do have a shower rod and shower like a shower liner nothing too fancy just something to get us through these first few days y'all know how the first few days are moving like everything is everywhere you just gotta go to the store get the bare minimum for y'all to survive you know that's where we are right now except ours is a little more extreme because we're also moving in to a renovation and renovating as we're moving in so <laughs> It's just a lot, but it's all good. I'm very grateful. I'm very happy and excited. So let me stop blabbing. I'm going to show y'all what's going on. So this is the bathroom. Like I said, it looks a hot mess, but he did get all the plumbing done. This is what he's been working on all day. Looks simple, right? Well, it took a very long time. <laughs> so he has that done. Um, like I said, he's going to put plastic. We are tiling this bathroom, which I think I mentioned already with a shower so he's gonna put durac up and then we're gonna towel it but for tonight he's just gonna put plastic up so that we could take a shower um clean out the tub all that stuff yes daughter toilet is fully installed we're good to go there still haven't gotten a vanity yet yes daddy put my shoes on okay daddy put your shoes on okay good Um, so this is what the room is looking like. As y'all can see, I mopped these floors today, believe it or not, um, with the Swiffer, but 
it still left a ton of debris. So my husband said he has a trick to that. Otherwise, I'll be mopping all day, every day. So he's gonna help me get all this dust and stuff up. And I'll show you guys the finished results once he helps me do that. But this is how the room is looking. We still do have to put another coat of stain blocking primer down and that on that wall over there. I don't know if y'all can see it. Probably not too well, but yeah. And then um, down here. Once again, everything is a mess. So y'all, I'm not about to give him disclaimers, but <laughs> we moving. This is the kitchen. He still has to hook up some lights for us. This is gonna be our tabletop for now. It's a pallet. Um, and I think he's gonna use like some sawhorses as the legs just for us to have a table um, to like put our cock pot and all that stuff on because as y'all know, we don't have, did I mention that? We don't have our appliances yet either. Nothing except our refrigerator. We did get a refrigerator, um, which we got a heck of a deal for. We got it on the on clearance. It was like part of the scratch and dent. If you guys shop at Lowe's, they usually have like a scratch and dent section, at least ours does. Um, and we got this refrigerator there. It was only $1,049, which if you're in the market for a refrigerator, you know it's a really good deal for this style refrigerator. So I'll show you guys what it looks like on the inside as well. <clears throat> I did go grocery shopping. So I have grocery here, here. Still haven't put everything up. I was gonna also do a grocery haul for y'all, but it's just chaos right now. <laughs> it's chaos, it's dark. And I just, if anything, I'll probably show you guys everything in the refrigerator and explain to you there. Like I still have stuff in the bags in the refrigerator. So it's hard out here, but we are fully, just about fully stocked. Um, so if nothing else, we gonna eat good up in here, okay? Fr freezer is full to capacity. We actually have to bring our deep freezer <clears throat> over here. Um, but yeah, y'all, I don't know how y'all eat out every day. I ain't say y'all, I don't know what y'all do, but how some people eat out every day. I was telling my husband, like, it hurt my heart to have to spend like $20 eating out today between breakfast and really just breakfast, I think, because we got like donuts and um, McDonald's and all type of stuff, not too much, but my son's a grunt boy and he wasn't full, so. I probably spent, I'm over exaggerating, I probably spent like $10. But still, the stuff that I spent $10 on, I could have made it home, but I spent two dollars, a dollar eighty nine for one hash brown at McDonald's. Y'all be paying a dollar eighty nine for one hash brown at McDonald's? No, ma'am. No, ma'am. I can buy a ten pack of hash brown for three, four dollars. Excuse me. Yeah, I was my, I was a little devastated about that. So, nonetheless, I went grocery shopping today to make sure that if nothing else, we could eat because I'm not about to be spending all my money out here. I got other things to buy, but. Y'all do what y'all want, which I might. I'm just saying what I'm gonna do. So yeah, that's what's going on. Um, my husband's still bringing a ton of stuff in between the plumbing and the table and we went to the, we call it the big house, which is actually our actual home. To reiterate, this is our investment property we are staying in temporarily until we finish our home. Uh, we call it the big house because we name our houses and that is just a very big house. <laughs> so that is what we named it. The big house, our dream home, etc. We went over there to get um, a bunch of groceries because we actually have fully stocked our refrigerator and freezer there because we thought we were gonna move into it a few months ago, um, but we didn't. And we had like all the stuff we, all of our original stuff we had brought from moving over there, like our tissue and cleaning supplies, furniture, all that stuff. We went and got the tissue cleaning supplies all that type of stuff today too. Sorry y'all, I know I'm blabbing, um, but this is what vlogging is, so. Yeah, that's what's going on, he's bringing all that in. I'll pick up the camera again once we have better lighting. Right now we only have light in three rooms. Well, yeah, well, only one light is actually hooked up. No, two, this light and then the hallway light, but none of the other lights are actually hooked up. We're using like lamps and stuff, so. When we have more lighting. So yeah, I hope you guys are doing well. I'll see you guys in the next one.